behind bars in Davis County tonight, accused of rape and sexual assault, and deputies fear there could be more victims out there. Yeah, investigators say the allegations are coming from two women who attended the same party earlier this month. New Special's Andrew Adams is live with what we know. Andrew. Dan, investigators say this guy used social media to organize events for singles, but we're also told tonight he did not organize this event in question. And we're told by people who were there, as well as someone who knows the victims, that they'd never encountered this guy before. The allegations are centered around a singles gathering that took place on August 6th in a Fruit Heights neighborhood. This particular event was more of a professional, fun event, um, supposed to be a very safe place. On the guest list was this man, 45-year-old Kevin Linford, a realtor tied to multiple other businesses. He's got money and power, and a lot of people are attracted to his lifestyle. That night, according to detectives, he showed a different side. It was shocking to be honest with you. Anna says she's friends with two women who fell victim to Linford. It's just been really hard watching my friends go through what they've been going through. According to a jail booking document, one of the women said the man raped her in a bedroom closet. The other woman said that Linford pulled her into a pool and sexually assaulted her. I mean, the fact that he was willing to do it in front of other people. It's a case that has investigators now taking a much deeper look. Currently, our information um, makes us believe that there are additional victims. Davis County Sheriff's deputies say Linford was an organizer of other singles gatherings, many of which took place outside their jurisdiction. Our number one concern is that he has hosted events for the past year and that he will continue to victimize people if he is let out. And I don't want him to be able to victimize and hurt another person. Anna says it's hard to contemplate the damage done to her two friends. That's why these girls need to come forward. He needs to pay for what he's done. She's hoping anyone else who may have fallen victim will have the courage to say something. It's just been horrible. <laughs> well, Linford was arrested at the Salt Lake Airport yesterday on his way back from Germany. Deputies say if anyone has fallen victim to him or if they know somebody who has, they're asked to call this number, 801-451-4150.